to understand how our noise sources uh, on the vehicle contribute to our exterior noise, we do what's called SPC or source path contribution. So we have what we call indicator mics located around the sources. And in this case, we're looking at the uh, powertrain, so it's around the engine. The same holds true with the tires and the exhaust and whatever we're interested in. So we have microphones put on the air inlet, um, as well as the air box. We also have microphones um, surrounding the engine. Uh, from here, we can only see the engine top mic and top front, but there's also microphones to the right and uh, to the left on this engine, and we have microphones surrounding it on the bottom and the front as well. And we need to understand the transfer path. How does the noise from here get to our microphone array measuring the exterior noise? So how we do that is we use what's called a volume velocity source. The volume velocity source has two microphones in the nozzle where this is a, a reference point and it's a point source. Uh, this connects to a speaker and an amplifier and emits a white noise. What we do with this is we would snake this up, and this is why this is on a tube, we would snake this throughout the vehicle to get this point source next to what we would consider a source uh, for the actual vehicle noise. In this case, this would be the air inlet. So we would have to snake this up behind the grill in front of the radiator to get this in place but we would initially want it to be in this area right in here. And we would do the same for the engine, and we'd do the same for the engine front, and we would snake up from the bottom to get the engine left and right, and we would do this for all of our source locations on the vehicle and make measurements to get the transfer function between the vehicle and the, all the other microphones in the equation. So to understand and measure the source of the exhaust outlet, we place microphones around the exhaust outlet itself. Typically, we will place the microphone at a 45 degree angle um, away from the outlet. This is to be able to collect the sound, but also keep it out of the flow of the exhaust. Uh, in this particular test, um, we are wanting to measure on the outer side of the exhaust, the uh, inside, and then we also have another microphone pointing towards where the center of the sound source would be from the exhaust. A challenge that we have, however, when it comes to indoor pass-by testing is the exhaust extractors. To get the carbon monoxide out of this chamber, we need to use these exhaust extractors right here which also poses a bit of a challenge as you can see that they make noise themselves. Regardless of whether you're measuring an internal combustion engine vehicle or an electric vehicle, one of the major dominating noise sources for exterior noise is the tire noise. So in order to understand its contribution, we have instrumented this tire with three microphones measuring the uh, contact patch between the tire and the roller on the outside. And we also have an additional trailing microphone and a leading microphone so that we can quantify the noise being emitted from the interaction between the tire and the roller.